with KHO and two weather, Justin Cruz. We begin a new work week with a few clouds, especially in the morning and the nighttime, <clears throat> excuse me, with partly cloudy skies for the rest of the day tomorrow. It's looking like a beautiful day. Currently, the temperature is 79 degrees, feels a bit warmer, but we do have trade winds. Let's take a look at the big picture. Number one, we do have a storm front to the west of the Hawaiian Islands. This is not going to affect us. It's just too far away. The only thing it's really doing is it's sending high clouds our way, and that's contributing to the cloudy skies. So that rainfall pattern that we're normally used to with trade winds remains, which are windward showers that ramp up at night and in the early morning hours, mostly dry in the afternoon. And then Wednesday through Sunday, a lot of these, th this entire uh, storm front breaks apart and moves away and it's pretty much done. And that's when we get the sunshine back because we're not going to have those high clouds filtering towards the islands. We do have some wet weather to talk about. A few showers tonight, but really tomorrow night, I know it's timed right during that lunar eclipse, but we do have some wet weather that will be moving into windward spots early Tuesday morning and late Wednesday night. So just a heads up because that uh, total lunar eclipse is happening tomorrow night. You might have to dodge some showers, but those showers will be moving quickly through. Most of the showers we're actually seeing right now are offshore, so most areas do remain dry. It was a bit wetter earlier today for Kauai. You see those windward showers, sometimes occasionally moving into leeward spots. Mostly dry conditions for Maui County with the exception of eastern portions of Molokai as well as Hana. And on the Big Island, just isolated showers so far. Not a very wet night for the Big Island, although you could see those showers from offshore moving through. We have large surf for the east shores tomorrow. That's trade swell at 5 to 7. No more than three to four footers elsewhere. Again, cloudy sky or mostly cloudy skies to partly cloudy skies tomorrow and Tuesday, election day. And then that sunshine comes back in a big way on Wednesday in through the upcoming weekend. There's no day this week out of the next seven that has more than a 20% chance of rain. And that is a normal summertime percentage. It looks to be on the dry side, except at night. Sam, over to you.